In this lesson, we learn how to create this handwritten whiteboard on Canva. After opening your video canvas, the 1980 by 1080, you can change the background to a dark color because that's just what I want to design today. The next thing you're going to press T to add text. And we're going to be using Comic Sans font because it's a whiteboard font and it goes very well with that. And then you write up your text. The next thing that you're going to do is you're going to animate your text. So you're going to click on animate and you're going to scroll down and make sure that you've selected text animation and you scroll down to the writing section. We want to use the typewriter and we want to use the typewriter on enter. So, and then it starts typing. You can reduce the speed. We're going to come back to the speed just now when we've added our hand and it's it's writing for us. So we want the hand to show like it's writing the text as it writes on our canvas. So then we're going to go to our elements and we're going to search for a chalk handwriting. So you can write it like that. Handwriting chalk or writing hand chalk so that you find one of these photos that have a hand that's writing using a chalk. You can click on your settings and then scroll down to look for cutouts. If you select cutouts, then Canva is going to show you all of these hands that have cutouts that you can use if you're using a Canva Pro. If you're not and it is a Canva free account, then you can get one from Pixabay or Unsplash and remove the background using the remove.bg. Once you've added the hand and you're then going to align it on top of the text like that. And then what we're doing now, we're going to animate the hand. So we're going to click on animate and create an animation. So we're going to drag the hand over the writing text so that it seems like it's writing over the text. So we're going to select the element and then we're going to move it like that. So the way that it's writing is slow. So I'm going to increase the speed. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to say done and I'm going to go back to my text and I'm going to go to the typewriter and I'm going to reduce the speed over there. Great stuff. So you're going to keep on doing this, going back to the animation and reducing the speed so that it is absolutely spot on okay i think I'm, I'm going the wrong direction i need to that's fast okay that's going back to the typewriter And if you pick up that it is your the way that you've animated, it doesn't work. You just delete the path and then you start all over again because I think I was slow. So what I'll do, I'll be a little bit fast when I'm animating this. So I'm going to drag it a little bit faster and then see, see, and then it works. For your last step, you're going to head over to your elements and you're going to be searching for audio. So you're going to type chalkboard and then click on audio and then listen to a couple of those chalkboard audios until you find the one you want. And then click and edit to your timeline, therefore your video and you're good to go. And once you're comfortable and you're happy, you're going to click on share and then you download it. So let's see how it looks like. Spot on. And that is how you create a handwritten animation for your whiteboard animation. Thank you for joining me on this tutorial. I will see you on the next lesson.